so I'm here not actually to praise you mostly, but to criticize you in an open sense. This is not a usual manual. It's not a motivational speaker manual. It's an interpersonal communication, actually, so mind it in the agenda next time. So, and the, all the projects that you have to fulfill within this manual are supposed to be well prepared, and they're not usual. They all consist of different parts. Normally, we come to the stage, we deliver some normal speech, we sit down. Here, you have, should have explained from the very first point, standing here, that this project will, be con will, will consist of several parts, and explain briefly which part will describe what. I would say, reading the description of the project, the first part, the ex explanation part, should take no more than five minutes, four to five. It took you seven. That was too long. Although Henry actually gave you freedom of time, this is not the point. Five minutes, stop. At least try to rehearse it. I would say that the first part could have been made by you more vividly. That was a bit boring. And you were right when you actually mentioned this at the end of your speech, that we, we were not bored to death. We were not asleep. But you could have made it you know, better, more joyful, giving some, probably giving some personal examples. Okay, man and a woman, a man and a woman example is good, is always good, it's interpersonal. But you could be that man, right? You could take some other woman, like your mother, you could argue with your mother, with your sister, with your girlfriend, anything. Any personal touch would make this project better. Then, uh, the second part. I would say, to my, I am a negotiator. I'm a marketing and a salesperson. That type of negotiation, of win-win negotiation that you try to demonstrate here, wasn't a success. You may, in this manual it says, you may not rehearse the project, but you can rehearse. And at least you can discuss with your partner the situation that you want to present, represent in front of us. As far as I understood, Sergei has just prepared six complex, difficult scenarios, no background given to us. No, no explanation Genius of prepared. what you prepared. Yeah, both of us prepared. Both of you prepared. Uh, Have you? I'm not sure if you if you actually discussed at least one of these scenarios in more detail. Japanese, Russians, um, lender, borrower, whatsoever. If you give us more background, at least in your in your you know improvising speech, impromptu speech. Let's say because you could have said at least. Okay, uh, Mr. B, uh, you remember we were partying with you together, so I can give you um, this and this service instead. Um, I wouldn't actually focus on the minuses and drawbacks of your win negotiation part, because there were some, we can discuss them later on if you want, but there was no win-win situation. You didn't ask a specific questions, you didn't get specific answers. Your partner didn't say, okay, all right, maybe not, this is not negotiation. You talk too much. You guys could have negotiated better. Talk to each other. Respond to each other. What you said was like, no thanks, not interested. So I would call it a win-lose discussion. And the third part, the ending part, that was quite good. People reacted, people listened, they, they got interested, they got involved. That's a good sign. Uh, but you could have made a better conclusion. Not thank you and go to your seat, but at least to sum it up somehow, to express your own opinion of this negotiation, to say if you're happy or if you're not, at least to give us some feedback on your own. This is a difficult manual and uh, this is not the easiest project. So next time, we, I read briefly the fourth and fifth project, they also involve lots of interpersonal role playing. Prepare it better, talk to your partner, make it a bit of rehearsal, add a bit of rehearsal to it, because we want to learn from this manual, not to have fun. Thank you.